Ethan. Is this is kind of up to feel to see me. Hi. Good morning, everyone. Today's vlog is going to be a quick um, tack up and ride with me. I'm having a lesson. It's currently like nine o'clock, nine a.m. in the morning. I'm gonna have a lesson at about half nine. It's got half an hour to get ready. Yeah, I'm gonna have a quick jump lesson. It's a bit windy this morning. But yeah, let's get started. So the first thing I do when I get him in is I take his rug and boots off. Then once I've done that, I put the massage pad on for him to have on whilst I get all my tack out and groom him just to warm up his back as they really enjoy having it on. And then once I do that, I just give him a quick groom over, you know, main forelock, brush his legs where he'd been out in the field and he was muddy, just give him a quick brush over. And then once I've done that, I always wet wipe their face, put a bit of butter in his mouth and tie up his forelock because he's got quite a thick forelock. Then I pick out all of his feet and after I've done that, I rolled up my bandages to bandage him because I love my incredible um, work bandages and I always use them at home. Just especially as our sand, our arena sand is quite waxy so it can rub on my legs. Then once I have bandaged and booted him up, I then saddled him up. I've got my Abute saddle, my Equip girth and then I put my child's own hat on, put his exo sheet on. And then once I've done that, I've put his bridle on. I like to use a fly valve, especially a soundless one, as it was quite windy. Then I unfortunately didn't get any videos of me warming up because mum was helping really put the jumps out. But I just warmed up, did a couple of warm-up jumps, and then mum started videoing. So yeah, I'm just going to let you listen to Ruby and what her critiques are and advice, etc. So yeah. We <laughs> probably freak out now because there's a box here. <laughs>
Well, the weather took a turn for the worse. It is currently raining. It's raining for my whole lesson. We are both soaked, um, but he was really, really good. I am very, very happy with him. I felt like I actually rode him better this time. We did a proper course. And yeah, I'm really, really happy with how he jumped. I felt like I didn't just sit there like a sack of potatoes because at the moment I'm just, I was lacking in confidence. So I would just sit there rather than actually ride in for the stride. And I just like, would ask him to find it which is not how you're supposed to ride especially as he's still only a baby but today i actually properly rode him and told him like no we went on this one and yeah he jumped a bit better we had no stops no hesitations nothing he jumped amazing but he's very very sweaty and then once i've ridden i untack obviously take everything off my saddle cover on etc then i always hose his legs off he was quite sweaty so i just got a sponge and i just wiped him over got all the sweat off cleaned my bit um i hosed his legs down gave him a brush over um i like to put ice boots on if i do a jump if we have a jump lesson so i put his ice boots on also and then i put his massage pad back on um just to help him and then i always do stretches stretch both sides just to stretch his neck out I then put his rug and all his boots on for him to go back out into the field and have a chill for the rest of the day. So Ryan is out, he's got some hay. I haven't got anything for you. No. He was a very, very good boy in our lesson, as you would have been able to see. So yeah, I'm really happy with him. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Not a long one this time, just a quick one. There's Ryan, munch on his hay. Just a quick um, video today, but oh. Okay, I'm confused. <sighs> yeah, like I said, it's just a quick video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe if you did. And I will see you guys soon. Woo!